Here I actually teach uh, what I actually believe in, which is innovation and entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurship is something that I had learned by doing uh, while I was in the Silicon Valley and I tried to imbibe some of those learnings to my students. Um, I try to teach them the challenges that an entrepreneur confronts while trying to scale up their ventures, which is where I probably uh, didn't get it right at that point in time. Um, I'm innovative myself. I try to imbibe what it means to be innovative and I try to in influence upon them the fact that innovation is just not about creativity. It's a systematic set of processes that exist within organization if organizations in fact want to be innovative. And innovation is probably the only way to survive what I call as uh, creative destruction. This is not my term. It is what Joseph Schumpeter described uh, as uh, destruction is inevitable for organizations and the only way for organizations to survive is being innovative. So in the classroom, I essentially focus on how firms can actually become these trial and error based organizations. I try and impress upon them that a standard organization is too uh, shy to try, so much so that not trying for them is a bigger risk than trying and failing. And that is the genesis of what I, I try and take them through. Um, I do a lot of other things as well. While I take them through this journey, I also talk about how can organizations organize itself so that they can produce innovation systematically. Just let's say, for, for example, like these big companies that are always innovative at the edge of the frontier, like, uh, you know, your favorites or my favorite, maybe like Google or Microsoft uh, and, and the companies that you, you might uh, actually name. This is what I do uh, for a living. Uh, I also do research in these two areas of innovation and entrepreneurship. So it all fits together like a nice glove, contrary to who, how I started off. Uh, I also do research in these areas. Um, a lot of my research is in the area of intellectual property and entrepreneurship these days. These days, I focus quite a bit on uh, the influence of crowdfunding, for example. I also study the gig economy, uh, the business models surrounding the gig economy. Uh, th those are certain things that I do. My recent passion these days is in the areas of uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning. I'm also trained as an econometrician, which means that the way I pursue econometrics has also changed over a period of time. I use more of machine learning these days in my econometrics rather than how I used to do it a few years back. Uh, but I also like to understand how AI is transforming organizations and decision making of managers. This is what I would like to teach and I'm going to be teaching the next few months, teaching managers how to imbibe AI and ML within their respective organizations and of course the challenges that come up while trying to do so as well. And that's what I do these days. I teach uh, strategic innovation management, which is a course uh, that I spoke to you about. Uh, I also used to teach uh, the entrepreneurship uh, core course at ISB. And I hope to see you sometime in my classes very soon.